What's going on guys, Ref here bringing you another Iron Man progress video. As you can see, I'm buying a bunch of pots. I'm going to train a little bit of prayer with uh, the Ectofunctus, just because I would, um, I'd like to get 85 combat kind of as soon as possible. And the Ectofunctus isn't too bad, and I'm not going to have a Gilded Altar for quite a while, so might as well get a little bit. I'm just going to buy like 500 pots here. If you didn't know, uh, this is in Zaya somewhere. I don't know, I've never really uh, messed around with Zaya, so... While I'm here, I am going to go ahead and kill some lizard men, try to get that talisman thing that lets you teleport here, because getting here is a just complete pain. So uh, I'm going to kill a bunch of those and hopefully get one of those talismans so that I can, in the future, come back here with absolutely no problem. But uh, after training prayer, probably going to do some slayer, some other stuff, maybe a few quests, you know, just the normal, normal, normal progress video stuff. So I will see you guys hopefully once I get the uh, lizard men talisman thing. Okay, so after doing that for like, who knows how long, I completely zoned out. Um, yeah, not doing that. That is, that is painful. I'm going to go ahead and uh, buy that for the future. I'm assuming Lizard Shaman, Lizard Men Shaman things will also work as well. So um, if I ever get those, even at a high level, I guess that would be useful just for killing those for the Dragon Warhammer. Oh yeah, I have jellies. I'm an idiot. Well guys, get like, you know, 20 kills into the task, get start chatting with a nice lad, and uh, realize that I'm not using my black mask. So that's awkward. Well guys, as I started collecting uh, buckets of slime for the Ectofunctus, uh, I grinded like almost 300 bones. Uh, it's just super AFK, so I just did it kind of while I was uh, doing other stuff. And I realized now that people actually are not buying buckets of sand and seaweed anymore. I can finally start getting all of my stuff to get my crafting up, so I actually don't have to worry about that nearly as much as I thought I would, so um, that's like a huge relief. Unless I'm just getting really lucky, but like the past like four worlds have been like completely stocked full on that, so that's amazing. Thank you guys for, uh, for, for getting your crafting done so I can, you know, do what I want. Alrighty guys, done worshipping all of those, uh, that got me up to 54 prayer and 83 combat, uh, probably close to 84, so as you guys know I am rushing for 85 as soon as possible. So that uh, was really useful, uh, good use of my time I guess, um, and yeah, I actually got quite a bit of seaweed as well, or seaweed, so dash, yeah, I have plenty of stuff. Um, basically, once I get 85 combat I'm just going to rush Lunar Diplomacy and Dream Mentor, and then I can start making all of these, start getting my crafting up, and uh, really start making the account look uh, beautiful. Alright guys, finished that task. The entire task, I didn't get a single clue. So that's like... Nope. 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 Okay. Okay guys, so before we do this task, I actually did look it up and I do have enough uh, ingredients to get to 64 Herblore. So I'm going to try to potentially get all these potions made. I'm not sure if I'm going to actually go ahead and go with it. I might just get up to like 62 so that I can make super restore potions and then start planting my like 40 snapdragon seeds and start getting uh, herblore up that way. That would be a little bit less painful because like I said, I do want to grab my Mortmire funguses, mo like the majority of them when I have the Mortinia legs three so that I can get double. But uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see. So yeah, while I'm making all of those uh, potions, I'm going to go ahead and uh, garden pie my way up and get a couple of snapdragon seeds planted. Just, I'm only one level away, so that way I can hopefully, I guess, avoid having to get so many more Myra funguses that I want to, like, cry. Um, but yeah, that, that should help quite a bit. And nothing actually died here. How about that? Okay, guys, I finally got myself this uh, talisman thing, so... There we go, that's how we do that. You just rub it, and I guess you can go a bunch of different places. So, say I want to go to the lookout. Boom. I'm now right here, back to where the lizard men are. These teleports are still really inconvenient. I feel like they should probably update them to not be, like, horrible. Um, none of them are anywhere near a bank or anything, like, really useful on Zaya. I feel like Zaya, in general, is kind of some content that really needs some love and attention. Um... I don't know, it just seems like a lot of this content's completely pointless and stuff. But anyway, 
Got that. Um, I just figured I was going to try to train up to 85 before I did this task, but eh, it's not really worth my time, so I'm probably just going to go back to Slayer. Oh, well guys, I am an idiot. I forgot to re like have my recorder up. I recorded like three different clips. Um, what happened? I got, I got some defense levels, and uh, I explained my plan. Let's see here. I was going to go. I'm trying to rush 85 combat, and I'm probably going to train prayer with the Ectofunctus instead of with Gilded Altar. And the most important one, which I didn't get recorded, I got another Zamorak page, and it was actually a unique one, so, uh, Zamorak page 2. Yeah. And then I made a joke about how my clue was 666k, point six. I mean, uh, that was pretty cool, but... No, I'm an idiot, and I forgot to record everything, so, uh, yeah. But anyway, another Zamorak page to the collection. That is only one more for that book, and that's one of the best books in the game, so that should be hopefully completed relatively soon. Oh yeah, by the way, I have, I have Pyro Fiends. That's, that's why I got that. I got I got it during my Pyro Fiend task, and now I have 97 more. So I just got my first Lizardman task. That's actually really good. Uh, tip, I might make a full guide on this. Um, it is fully multi-combat over there, um, and I might test it out on my main just to see if a cannon there, but a cannon right there might actually be like a really good fast task. But uh, the reason I'm killing them here is just they auto-attack you, it's AFK. Pretty good test, good XP, they have low defense, they have decent seed drops, stuff like that. But uh, you also need 100% favor before you can start killing the uh, shaman, shamans, whatever, for the dragon warhammer. So whenever in the future I start getting this task and I have 100% favor, I can actually kill those. And then, uh, you know, work on potentially getting that dragon warhammer for soloing the corporal beast, you know, obviously. Alright guys, finished that task. 60 tasks in a row, actually. Got a 50 point bonus. That's pretty nice. Uh, I got another talisman, but <clears throat> I don't think there's any purpose to having multiple ones. But one thing that I did here um, is that this actually does teleport you to near a third allotment patch? Oh, and magic trees. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, so I guess there is something useful in Zaya. But I actually never knew, knew this. I probably should have. But there is actually another... Uh, herb patch that I could be taking advantage of and it's yeah it's not far away at all so uh, I will definitely be using this in my herb runs uh, okay I thought the salesman was just gonna be kind of useful but no this is actually like a huge boost that's amazing okay there we go guys 62 farming can now grow snapdragons don't have to use these garden pies anymore although honestly like seriously guys uh, if there's this is like a huge tip for you iron men out there always use garden pies they are so easy to get um if there's like if you have herb seeds that you really want to use just grab a couple of uh, garden pies you can buy them from the cook's guild and they're really cheap i think they have quite a few in stock as well so yeah always buy always buy those don't don't like not do that it's not it's not a pain in the ass at all all right 58 prayer and 85 combat there we go uh, I finished up a blue dragon task, so I had even more bones. I might get to 59, potentially 60, probably just 59, if anything. Uh, but yeah, that is 85 combat. I don't have a task currently, so I'm going to finish up all these bones and grab a task off of Neve for the first time, so this should be freaking exciting. Alright guys, let's get our first task from Neve, see what she gives us. The Gonnets. Uh, okay, Dagonoths, okay? Listen, I'm going to tell you a story here, alright? When I, when I was a kid... I was playing this game with my friends. I used to call them Dagonis, okay? Or, uh, sorry, I used to call them Dagonoths. And my friends, both of my friends played RuneScape, and they would say, no, dude, they're, they're Dagonis, and they, like, would berate me, and they called me stupid. So now I just, I call them Dagonis. So, you know what? Just deal with it. Anyway, um, not going to do that task, obviously. don't need to right now, but instead, I am going to be doing Dream Mentor. I mean, I've been hyping it up forever. Said 85 combat, gotta get Dream Mentor, then I can make or do Super Glass Make. Do you even need? Does it tell you which spells you need? Okay, you don't even need Dream Mentor, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do it anyway. Cause I mean, what would this have all been about? All right, guys, here is the Lunar Diplomacy quest done. 5,000 magic and rune crafting. Got a rune crafting level off it also as well. Um, and yeah, that is pretty awesome to have done. Um, next is Dream Mentor. I don't think I'm going to really do anything in between. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to watch my old video and see how I did it, because I know I did that on a really low combat level. 
I might buy a dragon halberd for it, but I don't really have any money, so hopefully I can, I could, I should be able to do it without a dragon halberd. There we go, guys. Dream Mentor is now completed. Ah, that feels so good. I didn't even get a level for it. That is, that is sad. Anyway, what do I want? I want some XP. Uh, shut up, shut up, lamp. Uh, what XP do I want? Range is probably the most important, or the hardest for me to get right now, but I'm feeling magic, because that's, that's difficult. So, there we go. I still don't have high enough to actually use, um, what do you call it, super glass make, but I can boost it up with wizard mind bomb, so I think I'm probably going to be doing that next episode. Getting my crafting up, hopefully to 70, get some slayer rings. With slayer rings, I can do the, uh, method for cosmic runes where you can get through them without you know using glories which i will show you next episode in case you don't know what it is but anyway i'm gonna leave it at that uh, i got quite a bit accomplished and um yeah pretty happy with the results hopefully next episode we can really start taking off getting some getting some more gains so hopefully you guys did enjoy and i will see you later peace